Is it recording? Hey, everybody. Yep. Okay. Uh, I want to show you how to do the Weebles craft for September 5th, September 13th. Ooh. Um, next, yeah. <laughs> for me, it's this weekend coming up. It's to go with that scripture. Um, you will get in your packet an egg. Exciting. Inside will be a marble. Okay. And uh, a Play-Doh. Okay. Now, if you don't want to use the marble, some people might be leery of little babies or little children, you can tape eight pennies together. Because what you need to do is get the center of gravity for the egg in order for it to rock back up. So if I'm using pennies instead, will I need to use Play-Doh? You won't use Play-Doh. You're going to use a hot glue gun. Now, this craft is going to require... Um, adult supervision. Okay, so remember, if you are doing this project, it's gonna require mom or and or dad or grandma or somebody adults yeah. to help with this project. And if you are using the pennies, you don't need the play-doh. So I'm gonna go ahead and tape these together. Yeah. Mom, you go ahead and keep talking. Okay. And you won't need play-doh if you're using the pennies. Now I don't have pennies in the. <laughs> but typically people have pennies like in the bottom right the of their purses, something like that. Or you can um, get into dad's toolbox and get like uh, nuts, these bolts. And you can put those in the bottom. So I do, I take the pennies all the way around, stack them up. Stack them up. Okay. And for me, if I can get it open, I, um, is using, I'm using Play-Doh that's in the packet. That's fun. I like Play-Doh. Sorry. It's okay. It's fine. So I'm going to um, open the egg. Does Take it matter the, which piece you use? You're going to use the lower half because it's the half with the, if you can see. Not the pointy top. With the flattened end there. And I'm taking Play-Doh, warm it up a little bit, make a little ball. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Apparently, I'm not very good at You're not good at that. together. Okay. And after I get it into a little ball, I'm going to take it, put it in the bottom, and then mash it flat. See how it's flat there? I see that. Okay. No worries, Mom, on this. Uh, these pennies. I'll have Just them done before going. the end of this recording. Keep going. Then I'm going to take the marble, and that's best guesstimate as I can, I'm going to put that marble into the center of that Play-Doh. Okay. And nice. press it down. Meanwhile, we've got the pennies taped. Okay. Okay. When you have the pennies taped, you put yours in the center as best you can. Of center. the flat, the one that has the flat, flat bottom. bottom. Okay. I'm going to stick them right in the center with the flat part down, right? They can't see yours. No, but I mean the flat side, one of the flat sides of your pennies, not sitting on the rolly sides. Right down in the center? Right. Okay. Now you're going to put glue. Just glue it all, all around? Uh, cover it in glue. Co cover the Every, pennies. Yes. Yes. And um, with a hot glue gun. Now this absolutely has to be a hot glue gun to make this stick down, right? Yes. So what I'm doing here with mine is I'm actually, um, I've pressed the marble into the center and then I've kind of covered it with Play-Doh, if you can see. I pressed it down so as far as it can go and then I covered it up with the Play-Doh, okay? And then you can feel the base is kind of heavy now at this point. I think I need some more. You need some more glue? I do. I just happened to have a glue stick, so big Lots of glue. And you have lots of glue, make sure you have enough. You. Now, once I've done that, I'm ready to put the top back on. And I'm snapping in place. And already, you should be able to see it tip over, come back up. And I don't know if I'm getting that on the camera. That's pretty cool. It's not going anywhere. Now, to, in order to, you can seal it, she's still working on with the glue gun. Okay, I never said I was really good. Did I you, think I got enough? Fully covered? It's enough to make it, um, you're going to have to let it sit a while to cool. 
Yeah, because I can feel this is really hot, like on my fingers underneath the bottom. I think it should be enough. It's enough on the top. Yeah. So it's nice and coated all the way around. All the way around. It is not a little bit, guys. Can you see? Really coated. And if you notice, it's not going anywhere, even though it's still kind of warm. You're going to have to let that cool just a little bit. Okay. Now, uh, as I was saying, once you close your egg up, uh, if you want to, you can, if you leave it loose, then you'll be, always be able to unpop it. But if you want to make sure it stays sealed, you can take a little hot glue. Um, running around the edges. Running around the edges. You can take a little um, epoxy glue that you use for like toys and stuff. You know, that kind like of glue. A, not a little as, heavier than a, than a regular glue. Yeah, regular but not, not as glue. bad as that. What's that stuff? That like gorilla glue yeah yeah oh. you don't have to do that okay uh, but if you have you should have some tape because i remember i think our first packet we had tape just take a little tape and if you're it, anything like me you probably like to take stuff apart and do it again but maybe you want to show it to somebody else how you made show it what's on the inside mm -hmm. even with the tape uh it's, it's oh, yeah, clear and tape. you can't see it so you can still do it again that's pretty cool. And I don't know how long this Play-Doh will last without drying out. I think this will help you keep your seal. Ah, so if your Play-Doh dries out, you could put always get more Play-Doh and do and it again. Put it back in again. Appearance, though, um, just at my thought, you probably do want to glue that shut if you've got littles, because if they can get to those marbles, remember right. that's a choking hazard. Pennies, they're a choking hazard. So, you know, just keep those things in mind as well. You should be able to. Let's okay. check yours out. So. I think we're good yeah it's nice and cool to the touch so I'm gonna close this up let's see if she weebles I'm gonna make it juicy okay that is awesome and you know what I oh forgot oh my gosh what? I forgot I forgot you were supposed to put Christ on the inside where's what do you mean where's Christ here's Christ it's on the packet Oh, so I, ha, mine isn't taped down, so I can still do it. So we cut this out of the pack. I am so got. sorry. Ha ha. Because why? Why are we putting Christ on the inside? Because let's talk about that a little bit. We're talking about the lesson to, to today. Uh, it's about um, going to back to school, going back to school in a virtual world, and how things can be upside down, topsy turvy, and some people are you know really nervous, and when you have Christ on the inside. It settles you. Kind of like this Weeble that I'm trying to take apart now once I've taped it. Um, you know, can we talk about that just a little bit? Sure. Like, I really think it's, it is such a big topic. And I know that, you know, us as adults, we always talk about it. Um, and because of my job, I work with a lot of little kids. And, and, and their struggles are, are so complex. Um, and life right now is so complex yeah. with all this going on in the world and the community. And, you know, really even trying to figure out how to keep Christ at the forefront when, you know, there's so much social stuff going on and you can't see your friends like you want to. In school, you can't see your friends mm -hmm. and trying to stay connected. And, and you know, so this project of, of just like a visual reminder that you have to keep Christ um, in the center it's of every, center. everything. I wrote mine because... It's like a visual reminder, like keeping him here center. But this itself is like your visual reminder. Because this is you. Yeah. Mine this is, is you. Because I love pink. And when, as long as you have Christ on the inside, no matter what comes along. Yeah. Yeah. You know, you see the, the awful stuff in the news. You can't see your friends. You have to go to school online. Right. As long as you keep Christ on the inside. You got, there's coronavirus out there. Wear your mask everywhere you go. You can't go places because of coronavirus, right? Right. Gosh. But then no matter what life throws at you, and we'll do it on the inside of my hand. No matter what life throws at you, you you might Mine's not rock a little Look. bit. because But because Christ is your center, you're always going to come back to the upright position. Hey, mine rocks a lot. That tells you how I am. <laughs> always. 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 <laughs> always. And so, I love this project. That's so cool. Now that you have it and you have it taped or you have it glued, you, want, you, you know you're going to want to decorate it. Yes, of course. Now, in your packet, I've put some um, egg stickers. Uh -huh. But for me, I thought it would be kind of cool to put expressions on it. 
So there are also some little eyes and some mouths that you can cut out. I, you know what? Um, I suggest if you, you pull these out first, maybe color them. If you want to color them first, you want to color the tongue or, you know, color the eyes and stuff first and then cut them out. That would probably be cool. Probably easier to do that first if you want to, if you choose to use those. Rather then, than stickers. Right. And then, no, but rather than color them after you put them on, it might be kind of hard to color oh, them yeah. you know, once you yeah. put them on. And, and and a reminder, it's your it's your little person. Hey, and what's funny is if you take these on, then you can always change them up. Take them on, yeah. Right? How do I feel today? Today I might be feeling kind of wacky, so I want some wacky eyes. But maybe I'm feeling cute, so I want these cute little eyes right here with the little lashes and stuff. Yes, I love that. That's so awesome. So I'm just, still taking my clothes. So. You you <laughs> Sorry, guys. Well, I didn't. I stopped taking it clothes. I that is so it. cute. So, that is a great craft. You did, that was excellent. So, that's so we're the, remembering to keep Christ in the center. center of everything, of all that's going on in the world. And no matter what you're hearing, no matter who's saying what, or you know what side of the fence um, you're on, sickness or, or health, doing well, doing things are doing going bad. well, things are going bad. Um, you're in school or not in school, virtual or in class. Whatever it is, keep Christ at the center. If you're weebling and wobbling, you won't fall down. That's as right. Long as Christ is in the center. center. <laughs> That's a good one. Okay, Thanks, guys. guys. Have fun making your projects. Remember, adult supervision for this one. A lot of choking hazards. Be careful. Enjoy. I hope you're all being safe. Virtual hugs. Mm -hmm. Squeezing you tight. <laughs>